Lisa Macaroon. <laughs> Miss Quillers, I never had no illegitimate children. She never. doesn't have to worry about the estate then? No, 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 she don't have to worry. Amen. One of the things that I loved about my life when I was living was I was an actor. Uh-huh. I was a, uh, a method actor, as you know. Yes. In my movies, if I had to act happy, why, well, I'd just think about the lump of flesh on the back of my mama's neck. <laughs> Which you called... And then I'd smile. Yeah. And I'd feel good. Uh-huh. If I had to act hungry in my movies, I'd just think about some lamb stew, some chocolate bars, some beef tacos with cheese, <laughs> some donuts, some pickles, some veal parmesan, some pudding. You thought about all of that. All assorted condiments. <laughs> and I'd be hungry, and then I would look hungry. Uh-huh. And if I had to act dopey, yeah. well, I would just take a handful of Valiums, and boom, I would be dopey. <laughs> That's method acting? Yeah. And if I had to act sad, Mr. Quivers, yeah. well, I would just look down at my webbed feet. <laughs> With my six toes. <laughs> and curse yeah. my mama and papa, who uh, was probably brother, brother and sister. And sister. Yeah. So. This bit ain't sure too funny, is it? <laughs> I tell you. Well, well, this bit was bitten better than my uh You have my a little rasp in your voice there. I know, I think I'm losing my voice, ladies and gentlemen. That's what happens when you're dead. <laughs> your vocal quality just sort of goes. It goes, yeah. Well, I'll tell you something, I love the movies. I love my movie Harum Scarum. You ever see that? I think I did, yeah. In fact, in that movie I played Deke. In fact, in every movie I played Deke. I thought your name was Deke in every movie, yeah. You know what movie I love? What? Blue Hawaii. Did you ever see that? I loved Blue Hawaii. Blue Hawaii. That's also blue in Wisconsin, blue in North Dakota, <laughs> blue in Miami. Blue everywhere else, too. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, thank you, Thank you. Thank you. You know, how could they say that I had illegitimate children, ladies and gentlemen? Well, these girls keep coming up and saying they're your daughters. There was only one daughter, now my beautiful Lisa Bonet. No, 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 no. Yeah. That's Cosby's daughter. Your daughter is Lisa Marie. That is correct. <laughs> but I was always faithful to my wife, my beautiful Priscilla Marie. No, 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 Priscilla Priscilla Bonet. No. Priscilla Dilla Bobilla, Bonana Fetafocla. <laughs> Be my mom, Miller, and but... Well, me, you Ms. know, Carter. she just had another baby. Who that? M uh, Priscilla. She did? Yes. How'd she do that if I was dead, ladies and gentlemen? I don't understand. <laughs> Maybe it was with that Negro karate instructor that she loves so much. <laughs> I'll tell you, though, I, uh, I'm hungry. Anybody want to trade a banana for two Twinkies? <laughs> some soup, some nuts? You're into food swapping. I love my little girl, Lisa Day. Lisa Bidet. Lisa Marie. Lisa Monet. Lisa Day. Lisa Day. Lisa Day. Oh, <laughs> come, Mr. Tallyman. Tally me banana. You know what? I want to do a song for my I beautiful... Know you, wait a minute. I know you know your daughter's name. Yes, it's uh, Lisa, Lisa <laughs> Lieutenant Uhura. <laughs> wait a second. Am I Elvis or am I Captain of the Star Trek? <laughs> I'll tell you right now, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'd like to do yes. a little song right here for all the people who may be wondering if I have illegitimate children. All right, go ahead. I'd like to call this, I was horny one night. <laughs> was I horny one night? <laughs> Did I turn off the light and jump in the sack with some chicks? In between all those movies, did I sleep with some groupies to try to forget my bad flicks? <laughs> did their bellies start growing and I didn't know? Cause I was too high and stupid and slow. <laughs> Now they all want their share, but lady, I just don't care. <laughs> what matters is I'm horny tonight. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Well, since my baby left me, I find a new place to dwell. When it's down at the end of Lonely Street, it's heartbreak or death. I've been so lonely, I've been so lonely, I've been so lonely, I've been so lonely like a dog. Come here, Junior. Come on, Junior. Come on, What's his name? What is your name? Why don't you grab that microphone and talk to us? I love Elvis impersonators, man. I really do. 
because none of you guys look like Elvis. Don't stand too close. Don't, man. hey, get back. We have no idea what's wrong with you. Nobody's looking to stand near you. Well, I'll stand over here then. I mean, I'm doing this as a goof. I think you're living this. <laughs> you know? How come, like, none of you Elvis guys, like, are thin. I mean, why is it all the fat Elvis? Everybody's doing well, old uh, Everyone's Elvis. doing fat Elvis. <laughs> well, yeah, you look, but you don't even look like Elvis. There's a guy here. Come here. Look at this guy. This guy doesn't even look like Elvis. I mean, I look like Elvis. Look at this. I mean, you're doing a thin Elvis, but you look like a thin, you know, Ricardo Montalban. You don't look like a... You don't look like thin Elvis. You know what I'm saying, dude? You know, you know what I mean? Are you really supposed to be Elvis? Do you really... I mean, you don't even have... You don't even have sideburns, man. You got uh, Captain Kirk sideburns. A little... <laughs> Yeah. Well, what's your deal, man? Do you uh, do Elvis? I certainly do. Let me... You don't even sound like Elvis. I sing like him. Let me hear it. Well, since my baby left me... Make him leave. Make him leave. <laughs> Just get out. What's your deal? Do you do this, like, professionally? Yes, sir. Because this guy's... Yes, sir. Yes, sir, mama. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> what part of the South are you from? <laughs> Where are you from? New Jersey? Uh, Central Jersey, yes. Central You're from Central Jersey? Jersey? Yeah. Central Jersey. <laughs> Uh, a oh, part of the Confederacy. Yeah. From Central Jersey, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. No, it's just awfully pathetic. I mean that. Uh, I mean, you sort. Of, I guess he sort of sounded like Elvis when he was singing. A little bit, yeah. But well, thank you. But you don't look like. Like, do you have kids and stuff? No, I got. I got four boys. I got four boys, Mr. Stern. Well, that's I, better I know, than the I king know their could names. Do. Yeah, but do you think it's better than the king could do? Yeah, that is he true. couldn't have any boys. Yeah, that's right. The king never could have boys. He seemed to have made only girls. Yeah, even well, his illegitimate kids are girls. The king had a low sperm count, as we all know. <laughs> is that right? But uh, no, seriously. I mean, don't your kids sort of get embarrassed? What is your like wife? Do you dress her up like Priscilla Bolio and stuff? No, I don't go that far. You don't go that far. Do your kids go out of the house? My kids go out of the house. They love everything. Do you have really? like a normal job, or you just go around the country singing like Elvis? No, I have a normal job. You do? What do you do? What do you do? I'm a car salesman. A car a salesman? Car salesman. <laughs> but do you dress like that for work? Sometimes. Yeah. I can just picture something. This is my dad, retarded Elvis. <laughs> and you know, it's all good. He's got to go to work. He's got to go to work with those big pork chop sideburns. Did you go to work with your choppy sideburns? Yes, sir. Man, you look beautiful. And your TCB sunglasses. Taking care oh, of yeah. business sunglasses. Yes, sir. And those are very authentic. Have you been to Graceland and stuff? Yes, sir. Yeah, you do? Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> well, your big holiday is coming up pretty soon. Yes. <laughs> yes, sir. Are you going? Uh, ma'am. Yes, yeah. ma'am. Yes, it's ma'am when you go. All right, let me talk to some other guys. You're pathetic. All right. Sit down. <laughs> the guy in the red looks good. Yeah. Now, the guy in the red Why looks good. Why don't you step up? You step up. No, no, step up to the microphone, my friend. Well, now he smokes. Oh, he's Wait got a, a cigar, and he's got the... What do you, you do this professionally? 25 years, man. <laughs> Hold it a second. Whoa, I'm, look at I've that I've got thing. the jewelry to prove it. You look got at the jewelry, my friend. Is look that, at that real? You've got the phony stuff, my friend. I see. That's the real TCB. Is that real Elvis jewelry? This was given to me by Elvis. Yeah, what do you do? Now, why, now, why did Elvis wear a Jewish star, Robin? Why? Yeah, because he believed in the promised land. Was he circumcised? Is that it? <laughs> we all are. I see. But, uh, no, seriously. Do you perform around the country? Yeah. Well, thanks for using foul language, you. Uh... Elvis never did that, obviously. You're no. not Elvis would authentic. Never use, Elvis no, would never use the S word. No, he, you know? was, he would say, sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. That's correct. Let me hear you sing a little bit. Do something like Elvis. What do you like to sing? Oh, you lonesome tonight. Well, do you miss me uh, oh, tonight? Oh, please, sit down. Elvis would gas. <laughs> sit down. Sit down. I do a better Elvis. What's with the uh, cane? Did Elvis, when he got fat and bulbous, I guess, used to walk with a cane, didn't he? It was, it was a sign of authority. A sign of authority? Or a did he beat authority. the other guys in the Jordanaires with that cane? Yeah. <laughs> he used to I think he used to, like, beat all those old guys who played with him. <laughs> you know, you ever see when Elvis was performing on stage and he had all those old dudes behind him?